couple of secrets about me that you may not know. When I thought about going to architecture school, I got a lot of pushback from family members, friends, and everybody around me. Because where we come from, there's not many architects. Then I come to the States and I find out it's the same way too. There's not a lot of architects. Um, but I was so passionate and I am so passionate about what I love that I don't think you will ever find anyone with the same degree of passion as I have for this profession. Not only do I hang out with my architectural license, I also am proud to say that I won an AIA medal for the degree project at the Boston Architectural College and being the number one. And this medal reminds me that I, I am worth, worth it, right? At the end of the day, I am worth it. I am, I am somebody, right? Like that my passions and my dreams are coming into a reality every single day um, and I have more clarity. One day I actually lost this medal and was going through some rough moments, rough, rough, really rough times, divorce, things were going down. Um, the company was just, we were just pushing flow and it was very hard, like all of those beginnings. Um, and I had a sense of, I lost my sense of purpose um, because I was putting all of it here, right? In my AIA medal and all the awards I've been getting and all of that stuff. And at some point I had no choice but to make it permanent. And I love architecture and the American Institute of Architects so much that I had to literally make it permanent. And what I ended up doing was that I tattooed the American Institute of Architects logo in there and wrote the words, Bini Vici Vinci. I came, I saw, I conquer. Because it's been hard to get to where we are. It's been hard to increase diversity in the field of architecture. It's been hard for me. And I have to make it easier for all of you. Thank you.